here today we're looking at the Dr. Autec MTXR metal detector, um, fairly budget detector, um, around uh, 100 to 130 pounds from that online smiley shop, uh, although there are often discounts so you can pick them up a little bit cheaper. Um, so a budget detector with some uh, pretty advanced um, extras on there. So as you can see from today, um, I've got it on the all metal mode, you can see by the AM, but you can discriminate um, across each of the modes um, uh, as, you, as you see fit, you want to take out that iron. Um, you have a battery meter, you have a sound meter, um, you have a headphone socket, and when we see uh, or detect something we have a depth meter as well to give you an idea of how deep you have to dig. Um, so quickly just going to show you, uh, there is some iron I think under here, um, so um, we can try and locate it. There you go, you can see we're getting a, um, around 20, 16, 25, depending on what we're picking. Uh, it also has a pinpointing mode, uh, so to try and uh, hone in directly on where it is, once you see the PP come on, you'll be able to see it. And as you can see, we've pinpointed it around there. So audible alarm, quite uh, quite distinctive, particularly when you've got the headset on. Um, and, um, and, it, and again, you can see um, what this is telling us. We've got a bit of iron in there, around two inches deep. That's a depth meter. So all in all, pretty good. Um, as the machine goes, it has a, a standard uh, rest and strap. It's very light. Um, inside, um, the unit here is not waterproof. Um, uh, although, like uh, most coils, uh, they are, so uh, you don't want to be out in the pouring rain with this, uh, and there's no cover uh, either, so you can't buy a cover for it to try and protect it as yet, although I do believe from the manufacturer they're looking into that. So all in all, um, we'll give it a go and see what we can find. Thanks. Okay, well I dug this up but I haven't uh, done it, so I thought I would share it with you. Uh, a nice little squeaker around... Uh, 50 and uh, lucky what we can see. I haven't taken it out so the imprint should still be there so we'll do that together. So here we go. It looks like an old English penny. And a nice little imprint and it is. Give it a quick wipe. See what we can see. And there's Britannia. And the date is 1939. So there we go, one old English penny from 1939, dug again from the garden using the MTXR. So I'm not sure if you can see that. But, uh, there you go, 1939. Give it a quick wipe for you. There you go. Okay last find of the day. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember, like and subscribe. So, let's recap on today's find with our Dr. Rotec XR. Um, so, the junk first. Uh, we get uh, some kiddies motorcycle. Uh, a lid top, plenty of nails. Uh, I'm assuming that's a piece of lead. Uh, on the other hand, we also got um, some of the modern coins. Play twos and ones and halves, and an old penny uh, and a whole half penny as well. Still out in the garden, still uh, not ventured out yet, uh, so but still finding things with our Dr. Old Tech Metal Detector. Thanks for watching, and remember like and subscribe. Bye bye.